Hey guys, it's here from Mid-America Prep, and welcome to Mid-America Prep in the kitchen. Yeah, anyways, um, this here, this is a, uh, a thing, a MRE I got here from Bridgeford. I picked this up at Walmart, uh, just the other morning. Um, just got off work, it's 9.30 this morning, so I'm gonna go ahead and eat some breakfast and head to bed, but I wanted to do a quick video on these, uh, and do, you know, a quick review. Um, anyways, I saw these and I was like, wow, this is interesting, this is a new product at Walmart. I actually saw these at Cabela's first, um, probably about three weeks ago, uh, in Kansas City. And I was like, wow, there is no way that is an MRE. It says extended shelf life. Um, you know, it's ready to eat. And it supposedly tastes great. And it's unique. Um, biggest thing, it's made in the USA. Uh, this one is the, the ready to eat sandwiches, obviously, green. Um, this is the French toast one. There's two of them in here. So I don't know how big they are. But, uh, yeah, they're 330 calories a piece, 5 grams of protein, 49 carbs, or grams of, sorry, grams of carbs, um, and then zero trans fat, uh, 16% of your daily value. So, I don't know. Anyways, um, yeah, I, I saw these and I was like, there's no way I'm going to get one of these, but picked them up from Walmart, 4 97 for one, so it's like, you know, it's 5 bucks for that. 250 a sandwich. I don't know how good it's going to be. I just I'm going to get it out and see what it is about. Oh, okay. So that looks like probably an MRE type uh, uh, packaging. I'll look at it in a second, but let's keep on going here. Uh, Best Buy January 16th, 2018. So obviously it's not going to be like a uh, complete long term storage MRE. I mean, MREs do have an expiration date, so this isn't like a freeze dry. I mean, this is, this is, uh, I guess what guess would be an MRE. It's, it's not freeze dried at all. Uh, let's see, it has several different directions. There are ways you can cook it. Um, let's see if my phone will focus here. Uh, it's a sandwich is designed to be eaten straight from the pouch. However, it can also be heated via one of the following methods. Method. Is, method. Uh, as is, tear it open, fare the notches, and remove the sandwich and eat. You can you know, use an MRE or flameless heater. Uh, place uh, unopened pouch on an MRE flameless heater and the MRE, MRE flameless heater. Heating directions, tear open the pouch. So I wonder if there's a, must be a flameless heater in here? I will see. Um, boiling water, immerse unopened pouch in boiling water for six minutes, tear open the pouch and eat. Uh, microwave, remove sandwich from the pouch, wrap in the paper towel and microwave 20 to 30 seconds. Or the toaster oven, uh, remove sandwich from pouch, place on baking sheet and place it oven, in oven at 350 for 8 to 10 minutes. So, um, I have just my regular oven here, so I guess I'll turn it on. It's at 350. I'll try that. If it has a, I'm going to go ahead and preheat this. Um... If this does have a flameless heater, which doesn't say it has one. Yep, it does not say um, that this has a flameless heater in here. But if it does, I'm going to go ahead and use a flameless heater to see. At least for one of them. Uh, I don't think I can handle 660, 660 calories this morning for breakfast alone. So, let's see what it looks like. Alright guys, so as I noted, or I, I thought, uh, there is no flameless heater in here. It's just the two packages of the French toast uh, sandwiches. And so I'm going to go ahead and keep the oven going on. I'll, obviously I'll wait for the oven to preheat. Toss it on, toss one on the pan and we'll try it out. Uh, yeah, so as you can see, there is nothing in there. So it says to use an MRE flameless heater. So I guess, I mean, they do have them out there for individuals. Uh, you know, just, you can buy a you know, a dozen of them at a time or 20 of them at a time and use them whenever you want to, but I figured I might have one here, but it doesn't. Okay, so I have it torn open. Um, has this, obviously, the uh, little desiccant pack or whatever, the fresh pack, uh, so it eats the oxygen. Um, anyways, let's see here, the first impression. I don't know if you can hear it. It's kind of dry. But maybe there's some icing or something in there. I don't know. Maybe these little wider spots or some kind of icing or something. I don't know. Hopefully it'll... It's not rock hard. 
I mean, it's, it's pretty stiff. Hopefully if it gets warmed up and cooked, it'll kind of calm down and soften up and taste good. It smells like French toast, but uh, we'll see what it tastes like. Sweet, it's fast. I put it in for six minutes instead of eight to ten minutes. I didn't want to uh, do a whole lot. I mean, obviously, there we go. All right, so there we be. Kitchen's a little dirty today. It's only almost ten o'clock in the morning. No need. I need to do just dishes today. All right, let's see what we're working with. Just gonna take that and we're gonna throw on our plate. Okay. Let's cut her open. You know what? I'm just using the old boss knife here. What are we working with? Alright. Well, looks like 330 calories worth of food here. Um. It is hot. It's got like a like a syrup center. If you can see that, I hope my camera will focus. Uh, anyways, yeah, it got like a syrup center in the middle of it. Pretty pretty neat. It's like a soft pop tart, really. Pretty interesting. Glass um, of milk. I bet it'd probably be better cold. You no, know, not warmed up. It's pretty good warm, but it'd probably be better right out of the package. Especially if you're hungry on the trails, so. Anyways, that's a Bridgeford Ready to Eat sandwiches. French toast. And they've also got like a beef sandwich. I'm going to pick up that. And uh, I'll do a review on that when I get it. So, anyways, this is the Infamous American Fret. Reminds you to not go to bed hungry. <laughs>